All right, this is the best way to dissolve a hurricane, whether it's out in the ocean or if it's inside your heart. There's three steps to it. First one is to ask yourself a question to get yourself into neutrality, to get rid of any negativity that you might be carrying with you because, you know, life's hard. And you do that by asking yourself the question, why do I love discovering what's between me and loving kindness? And I would suggest you do it twice. Second time, focus on the word love. Why do I love discovering what's between me and loving kindness? So that whenever you have, you can use this question anytime for any, any issue that you have, big or small. And it will help you move from the evidence of why you feel bad to a new place of neutrality, because when you say it the first time, you focus on the word discovering, and your mind automatically, your brain, hardwired to find the answer, puts you in neutral, in neutrality. And then when you say loving, it puts you in positive mode with gratitude. So once you've done that, the next thing you do is you recall the most joyous time and moment in your life. For me, he would have been holding my son when he was first born. Um, if you don't have a time like that, or, or any that you can recollect, create one that you wish would happen and get that feeling. And, it, and the idea is to get the feeling in your heart. You drop the circumstances totally. It has nothing to do with me holding the baby. It's me feeling that energy. And the more intensely I feel it, the stronger it is. So once you get that feeling inside of you and you're in a place of neutrality or positivity, then you just feel grateful. And I suggest you feel grateful to God for, for that feeling that you have inside of you. And love God and even praise God. If you believe in God, praise God. And if you feel any kind of negativity come up, maybe you feel guilty about something, something you've done wrong in the past, be grateful to God that He forgives you. He forgives you. So when you and when you focus on the storm, what you want to focus on, because in this in the case of Milton, the waves are already being created and they will arrive even if the storm dies. So what you want to focus on is not avoiding the damage or getting the storm away or any of those are those are actually negative thoughts. You want to Imagine the water being so beautiful and calm and wonderful and we're grateful for how it has cooled off the golf already, which is a good thing for the golf to have the, have the water cool. If it gets too warm, it's bad for marine life. So we're just so grateful. And the longer you can do this, the more powerful it is. The more people you can do this with, the more powerful it is. So but you can do this and it, you don't have to be doing it simultaneously with someone else because there is no time in this process. It's all about feeling present. Feel the presence right here. Lightly touch your hand to your heart. You can close your eyes when you do it and just feel that joy and create that joy. And you know, for me, it was a baby. You know, I, one lady told me it was being in the front row of, of a Bruce Springsteen concert. So whatever floats your boat. Get that feeling because you're dropping the circumstances. The circumstances that created that for you in the past has zero to do with this. So you're not you're not trying to relive the past. You're bringing it present, or you feel it right here in your heart. Feel it emotionally. Feel it in your heart. Just love it. And as you do that, it'll go up to your brain, and your brain can check it out and see if it's the right thing to do. And so you're going to have coherence between your brain and your heart. So go ahead and, and take the time to do that. In fact, let's do that right now. Well, I'll first ask the question, why do I love discovering what's between me and the loving kindness? Why do I love discovering what's between me and loving kindness? And now let's just bring in that joyous moment in our life and we drop the circumstances and we just feel that joy in our heart right now and we go with it and we see the beautiful water being calm. We don't have to know how it works any more than we know how it works when we turn on the light switch and the light comes on. We just enjoy having the light on and that works really, really well. So you don't have to know the why. 
just have to know that you're feeling loving in your heart and gratitude. And by the way, you can use this not just for hurricanes, you can use it for any hurricane in your life, your personal life. Go ahead and ask the question and, and then find that joyous place that you feel in your heart. Thank you and God bless.